Welcome to the Arsenal channel. Today we're going to be talking about legendary sigils. Legendary sigils are wonderful things that you can make. You can do it. I believe in you. You can make them. And what they do is they replace your need for sigils in the game. If you get a full set, you no longer need any sigils. You can either sell them, you can scrap them, or you can send them to your friends. They are no longer an issue. They, the system remembers them on every single tune you have, just like it remembers the dies that you place on them. So it's absolutely wonderful. I made two a long time ago. Uh, that, that video that I made for that was just like show and tell of like, here, look what I just did. This one is going to be a little bit more detailed. I'm going to show you exactly how you can do it too. All right, here we go. Legendary Sigils. Today, for this one, we're going to go down to the bottom first. We're going to look at our Gift of Condensed Magic and our Gift of Condensed Might, the standard gifts that you need. You throw all of your, your eight major mats into the Mystic Forge together, and you make your gifts. So save up on your, those mats, and I'll be going over those in a second. You also need a Gift of Craftsmanship. You need one for each. There are 50 Provisioner Tokens each. You can buy Provisioner Tokens in every major city. Uh, gift of Sigils. 75 obsidian shards, save those up. 150 globs of ectoplasm, save those as well. Mystic clovers, a little bit harder to save, but save them. Uh, 30 is what you're going to need for each one. You need 20 for runes, 30 for sigils. So, yeah, a little bit more expensive, but there, there you go. Now, 75 mystic motes. Mystic motes are actually pretty expensive. These mats over here, the symbols of control, the symbols of enhancement, the symbols of pain, these can be a lot on the trading post, so save your gold. And by the time you have the gold to buy all these, you should buy osmosis, probably have the materials for the rest of it. So that's, that's how you do these things. And piles of lucent crystal, that's a lot of them. But, you know, it's more than you think, but yeah, you're going to need them. Okay, so let's make those gifts that we need for each of these things. For the condensed might and magic, we're going to take our blood, our bones, our claws, our dust, our fangs, our scales, our totems, our venom. We're going to throw them into the Mystic Forge. Lots of them. You see these lists of, of tier 6, 5, 4, and 3 mats. There we go. Now, Mystic Motes. These are the ones that are expensive. And boy, does this hurt. But here you go. you got to craft them all. I'm making 150 because I'm making two legendary sigils today. So this is them going all the way. Wave your gold goodbye. There it goes. Goodbye. <laughs> now let's look at them in your inventory and here they are and let's split them in half let's hold our alt key down and drag and it'll automatically split it into half for 75 if you want a specific amount you type them out but there you go there's half and we're going to just line them up here visually for reference there we go there's our two that we're going to be making okay now let's do our final thing let's go get our gift of craftsmanship using our provisioner tokens that we bought up here's, a, here's where the script vendor is in Lion's Arch the one I always use and there you go. Actually, the cheapest one is in is in uh, Black Citadel. Okay, there we go. Take that there. Now let's forge those those gifts together to make our gift of condensed uh, magic. Ta-da! There it goes. Refill. Make another one. Now we've got two of them. Gift of condensed magic. Let's go to our inventory and let's drag them down here because we're OCD and put them there. <laughs> and let's take uh, the Mystic Forge and make our other four that match up together. The Mystic Forge is wonderful. It tells you which ones go together. You don't have to think about it. There you go. The Gift of Condensed Might. Let's refill and forge again. And we've got more Gifts of Condensed Might. A second. Let's drag that down here for, for neatness. Now, let's take those 75s. And, and those and that and put them together like we said and we're gonna forge and we get our gift of sigils ta-da let's drag that down to where it's gonna go in its final position and I could have refilled but let's be dramatic let's click on all four like it's the coming of the gods together there we go the gift of sigils dun 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 now we got two now it's time for the final forging and they put them at the bottom, so we're going to reload our Mystic Forge. And now it's where, the, where we thought they'd be. Gift of Craftsmanship. Let's make them. Gift of Sigils. Uh, condensed Magic. And there's our Condensed Mites. And we're going to forge them. Final forging. Here we A go. Fitting reward. The Legendary Sigil. I believe that sigils contain fragments of memories from the greatest battles in Tyria's history, Lady Nari wrote. 
This one may be our only window into the Battle of the Three Queens. That's a, that's a lore lookup for you. Look that up in the wiki. It's pretty interesting stuff about Cantha. All right, here we go. Uh, there we go. Now we got three. Okay, let's go uh, make our last one. So, refill and forge. Dun dun dun. Items unlocked in your legendary armory are available for all of your characters. They can be found in the equipment tab of your hero panel alongside all of your other equipment, just like I said before. Wonderful things to have. All right, let's close that. Accept it. Now, here we've got a legendary uh, great sword here. It's got. Uh, let's, let's let's replace this sigil of accuracy with this upgrade. It's not going to destroy the accuracy because it's a legendary weapon. So let's select our legendary sigil. Let's choose accuracy. Let's go down here and accept it. And there we go. It's on there. And if I replace it on all templates the item is returned to me. Now, you may have to, uh, you may have to get extraction devices for ascendants or for exotic weapons, you may have to scrap them with Black Lion salvage kits to make sure you get your sigils out of them. And then you can sell them, you can scrap them, or you can give them away. I'll see you next time on the Arsenal Channel.